Hey, well, here we are three weeks later. Three weeks later. We're finally out for a run. But we really need to ramp up because we have lots of plans, lots of things to tell you. So stick around. We'll see you in just a little bit. Uh, to be fair, we have been working out. We'll tell you a little bit about that later. But man, I'm puffing and puffing. I feel like we're running a little faster than usual. So it's definitely faster than usual for the last three weeks. Yeah, that's true. Maybe we just want to get it over with. I know, I do. Hey! Hello! Hey, everybody! Oh, man, we are still riding high from Marathon Weekend that happened, I don't know. Like a month ago. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But... As you saw, we ran three miles today. Mm -hmm. uh, and again, we haven't done any running since the marathon. Yeah, so we mentioned um, in our, I think it was in our recap. So we, we tried to go running. We did go, we ran one mile. On Wednesday following the marathon at our resort, we ran, we ran around, a mile. We you know, well, there's a lot. It was rough. It was not <laughs> enjoyable was in the least. Yeah. So at that point I was like, I think we were both were like, yeah. we're just gonna not. Yeah. Let's Do listen this. to our bodies. We always say, well, mm -hmm. we should we listen do. to our bodies. Yeah. We never listen to our bodies. Yeah. But this time we did, yeah, and we I'm did. really glad we did. Yeah. So we didn't run at all since that Wednesday mm -hmm. until today. And it felt great. Yeah, it did. It, really, it, <laughs> it, it, felt actually, great. it actually did. It was nice uh, to take a break. So what we decided to do, we shared with you, we are going to do our best to run every day in February. And that's something totally brand new. And that us. starts next week, by the yeah. way. We're already oh, there. Man. So yeah. that's one thing that we are planning to do. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, hopefully uh, you'll uh, stick with us and uh, cheer us on and find out how that goes. However, what we did do is we started a six-week training program. We started, okay, so here's what happened, actually. <laughs> so we looked at, so it's a six-week, you know, fitness restart, whatever. And it's right. on Apple Fitness Plus. Uh, we really enjoy the workouts uh, through that app. So it's like, oh, great. They'll pick the workouts for us, so right. we don't have to like sort through them. Right. Great, right. let's do this. So I looked at it, and it was three weeks worth of things. So there was three um, three rows, seven workout workouts each. I'm like, oh great, three weeks. So I put it on our little calendar. Of course, I made a new calendar, a new tracker for us, yeah, right. and I you know mapped it all out. And then I'm like, okay, after those three weeks, we're going to do this other thing, blah blah blah. And then I read the instructions <laughs> and realized you were supposed to do each week. Twice. So yeah. we're not doing a six-week thing. We're doing a six-week thing, but we're doing it in three weeks. Right. Oh, well. <laughs> so anyway, we're going to do this in three weeks. We so, just wrapped up week one. So we've been doing that. I think one of the reasons why the run felt so good today is that every other part of my body was uh, really hurting. <laughs> we've been doing some upper body strength yeah. stuff. It's pretty good stuff. Hit workouts. It's pretty good stuff. Yeah. So, you know, we're, we're doing that. And then... <laughs> And then, like we told you, we've got all these plans. So he, here's what's going on. First and foremost, the most important thing is our our precious dog, Millie, uh, has an injury. She's a mess, y'all. Um, so she's a mess. Bless we're her. taking care of her. Uh, she's in the cone of champions. That's, that's what we call it. She's doing a great job. Uh, she is. It looks like she may have to have <laughs> knee surgery again. So she, uh, yeah. It's, it's, it's not rough. as dire as it sounds. Yeah. She blew her dog equivalent of an ACL several years ago, and she went through some pretty intense surgery yeah. to correct that. Yeah. So they actually had to like cut her bone, basically like break a bone, cut a bone, reconfigure it to like allow her little knee to sit there mm -hmm. without moving out since that tendon was gone. Yeah. Right. So she had that surgery. She had a plate and some screws, of just like me. <laughs> yeah, right. She just wanted to be part of the group. Yeah. Um, that was years ago. She's done great. Everything's great. Mm -hmm. Well, at some point over the last like six months or so, either the scar or the plate or something else, and it's just a coincidence on that leg has been bothering her. And she's like, just been at it and at it and licking and yeah. gnawing. And it's like, it got really bad when we went out of town yeah. because we weren't there to be like, Hey, stop it, yeah. stop it, stop it, stop it. You know? Yeah. 
So, so it got infected. It got infected. Uh, we had to take her in. She's on antibiotics right now. Very gross. Uh, it's it's really bad looking, but it's getting it's better. Getting better uh, which is amazing. And, and it still looks she, rough. She's awesome. So anyway, all that oh, to say. All that to say, we think the hardware is going to have to come out. Yeah, they, they might have to take the hardware out. So we're going to have to take it back to the surgeon. Everybody loves her. We love her. Uh, she and, hates everybody. Yeah, she hates everybody. She can have so but many us. friends. But yeah, yeah. She, she loves she us. Has so many friends. So the thing is, now we need to figure out what we can do uh, because we have to take care of Millie. We're not going out of town, and we don't know for how long right. we're not going out of town. Right. So, like all of our tentative spring travel plans, including like potentially some overnighters for some runs, uh -huh. are not happening. Right. But what is happening is we we're gonna run our local Cupid's chase mm -hmm. in February. That's in like two weeks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's a that's a five k. That's always been fun. It's and a lot we, of fun. We have our videos mm -hmm. where we've done those, uh, but we're definitely gonna run a half marathon. This is awesome at uh, Blue Bell Ice Cream. Uh, it's in. Uh, uh, the local legend in, yeah. in Texas. Everybody yeah. loves Blue Bell. Uh, ice cream company has been around since 1907. You know, they have an awesome slogan. Their slogan is... We eat all we can and we sell the rest. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. so... Did so, they still say that? That's the, yeah. Those are the commercials I remember. Yeah, 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 yeah. That, that's the that. slogan. And what's yeah. really cool, part of this half marathon is... Your finish line prize is you get to eat as much ice cream as you want. Now, here's the thing. I don't know if that's going to be good for us or not. <laughs> I've never eaten ice cream after a race. I have drunk hot cocoa after a race, and it that. ended tragically. Yeah, that, was, that was awful. We pulled over. So I think we need to start one. practicing that now. <laughs> but anyway, hey, we're signing up for the Blue Bell race. It's yeah. a half marathon. So we need to start ramping up, right? We need to start getting back because we're going to run a half marathon. So that's one of the uh, activities, and that is... Out of town, but it's close enough for us to like get there. Like an hour and a half ish, yeah. we can we can pull it off. Yeah, so we'll have a lot on mm -hmm. that when we do it because it's really cool. It it is a, an amazing place and make amazing ice cream, and we'll be able to you know get some footage and and uh, then you get to watch us just eat as much ice cream as we physically it's can. It's probably just going to be yeah, one serving, probably one bar of something, and it's like oh let's go home. Anyway, <laughs> I'm so full. Now the other thing is, and, oh, and well, we have well, we have a lot of ifs mm. ands. But, or... Uh, I, I actually have taken this, like, whiteboard app and mapped out, like, what we need to mm -hmm. try to sign up for and when, and if we get in or not, what that means. This is a uh, Run Disney events, of course, yeah. because the, the other events you can just sign up for, and the, it's no big deal. The diagram is uh, amazing. It's just like, <laughs> if, but, if not, then, but, because... So, step one is on February 14th, we're going to try to register for the Disneyland Half Marathon, because we like Disneyland a lot. And we've never run a race there. And so is everybody else. And so is everybody else. So So Disneyland, so, California, they come back, run Disney's back. Mm -hmm. We're gonna try to get into that half. We're gonna try to get into that. So and let's then, say that happens. Okay, so if yes we get in, we are going to try to still pull off marathon weekend, but not the full marathon. No. Because I don't think given this year as an example, I don't think we're gonna feel like running a half marathon yeah, the next yeah. weekend if we run a full yeah. marathon. I think we can run a half marathon right. and then run a half marathon. Right. So we might <clears throat> try to swing that. Right. That's our first plan. And the logistics are crazy, right? Yeah, because, you know, we live in the middle. One race is over here, the other race is over here. It's going to be like cashing in credit card points to get some, <laughs> all those flights. <laughs> but Think of um, all the plasma we're going to have to swing. <laughs> so <laughs> that's if we get in, uh -huh. that's that plan. Right. If we don't get in... We're gonna go for the marathon and potentially look at maybe doing Castaway K. Yeah, maybe. Challenge. Never done it. Not that we've been talking about it, probably not the challenge because I don't really feel like paying another $60 for a medal. Yeah, yeah. We'll probably just like take a cruise, which is a first for us. Yeah, it'll be. It'll and, be um, you know, and maybe try to run on a, mm -hmm. you know, Caribbean island. That yep. sounds nice. Um, Anyway, that's like phase one, but there's lots more. We're also, um, for next year, we're thinking, um, pretty sure whether we do the Disney World Marathon or not, we're looking at doing the Calgary Marathon in May. So one thing about that yeah. is that, first of all, that's over a year away, so we have time to do this, right. but they have a cutoff of six hours, which is faster than our current marathon. Best. Yes, yeah. by a bit. So that would be so tough. So that would be, be like us. something for us to actually like yeah. train for yeah. and like try to accomplish right. is shaving 30 minutes off our best time. Right. 
the other thing is, uh, I am I I think we're at ninety nine point nine percent sure that we're going to uh, do wine and dine uh, this year. We've never done wine. Yeah. And dine, so we think we're going to do that. We did sign up in twenty twenty. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We ran it virtually around yeah. our neighborhood. Yeah. Darn it. Yeah. So, you so know what? we think we're going to do wine and yeah. dine this year. There's some other There's some uh, other ifs events that and may, events. may be interesting if it works out. Yeah. But. So, uh, uh, yeah. what what of those things revolves around possibly uh, participating one more time in a dapper day? And this also hinges on whether or not we get into the Disneyland race, because yeah. if we do, then we're not going to do this like coast to coast thing. Yeah. Anyway, whatever. Yeah. We have lots of tentative plans. Yeah. And then a long period right now with no plans. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. While we try to get yeah. silly Millie, yeah. except for running. except for doing the uh, the 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 workouts because we really need to our three weeks um, next week program and, and doing the February running every day. I, 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 we're really curious. What? See what I, is that going to do? Yeah, man? everything How that I've read that? says if you want to get faster, you need to run more often. And we're always like, nah, <laughs> we don't want to get faster that bad. So um, <laughs> we'll just. Um, Try to run twice a week and see how that goes. Yeah. So I'm, I'm curious to see if, it, yeah. if we see any difference yeah. trying to get out there for at least a mile. We're not running like huge distances every day. We're just mm. going to try to get out. Like we're going to walk Millie and then we're going to try to, although if she has uh, surgery, we may not be walking Millie. Oh, uh, and the thing oh. is too, is uh, we are going to have to train for a half marathon. So our Saturdays mm -hmm. are going to, you know, yep. those, those numbers, our mileage will go mm -hmm. up on Saturday. But, yeah. you know, anyway. That's what's going on with us. Yeah. Uh, you know, we want to thank everybody for watching. Thank you so much. Uh, we had a just a it was awesome meeting new people, uh, seeing you. So uh, please let us know how you're doing. Uh, comment on this video. Hey, if you like it, like it. But thank you so much to all our subscribers. Uh, thank you for watching. And remember, we do our best to upload <laughs> once a week. And you know, we're gonna have a lot. To, we're, we're we're doing a lot. Yeah. We really are. Yeah, for not having any definite plans. We have a lot kind of coming up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, think of all the things that uh, I get to uh, cancel. Like, mm. Oh, sorry, I got to run sorry, out of that yeah. day. Oh, no, we'd love to come over. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you all for watching. I mean, plans, no plans, maybe plans. <laughs> Always an adventure with you. We'll see you soon.